What is diabetic ketoacidosis? Diabetic ketoacidosis is a severe and life-threatening metabolic disease. It occurs when the body cannot use glucose as an energy source because there is no insulin or a shortage of insulin. The body switches to burning fatty acids and producing acidic ketones in the blood and urine. Ketones are poisonous in high levels. This condition is called ketoacidosis. What are ketone bodies? The breakdown of fatty acids in the liver produces three compounds. 1. Beta-hydroxybutyric acid. 2. Acetoacetate. 3. Acetone. These three collectively known as ketone bodies. Beta-hydroxybutyric acid comprises approximately 78%, and acetoacetate is approximately 20% of the ketone bodies. Acetoacetate is unstable and breaks down into carbon dioxide and acetone which comprises the remaining 2%. Why we need to monitor the ketone levels. Normally ketones can be break down into CO2 and H2O by the body. The increase of ketones causes acid, base imbalance, which leads to ketoacidosis. If is not diagnosed or treated in time, ketoacidosis is potentially fatal. What are the methods for testing ketone bodies in laboratory? Test ketones in urine using dipstick technology. Many hospitals still use the nitroprusside urine method to produce a qualitative assessment of ketoacidosis by detecting both acetoacetate and acetone. This method may not be reliable and may require confirmation by a reference lab. Ketone body test can be done in serum using reagent on biochemistry analyzers. Blood ketone testing method that quantify beta-hydroxybutyric acid, the predominant ketone body, is preferred over urine ketone testing for diagnosing and monitoring ketoacidosis. This method had been recommended by American Diabetes Association in 2004. Why is the beta-hydroxybutyrate test important? Beta-hydroxybutyrate test is significant because nitroprusside urine method detects less than 25% of the ketones present in ketosis. Beta-hydroxybutyrate test detect the major ketone produced by body. During ketoacidosis beta-hydroxybutyrate levels increase immediately and increase more than levels of acetone and acetoacetate, providing an earlier indication of metabolic trends. The excellent stability of beta-hydroxybutyrate making it the most reliable indicator of ketoacidosis. Quantitative and objective beta-hydroxybutyrate results provide a better method for differentiating ketoacidosis and monitoring therapy. If you are interested in my video creation, like this video, feel free to give your comment. Please subscribe us on YouTube.